I went out and brought home six chickens and put them in the bathtub and decided to have chickens. And then I went on to build a coop. I wasn't very popular at first. But the chicken quickly roosted to fame, especially after they were moved into the backyard. John Wilson says once he owned chickens, it becomes a passion. That's why I built these ridiculous buildings behind us. This coop has video surveillance, Wi-Fi, and electricity. Coops don't have to be glamorous, though. They just need to provide a safe home. You can build a coop probably for free by collecting pallets and woods and, you know, nails, bang one together. What matters most to a chicken is always having access to fresh water and food, a safe place to sleep, and an area to run around. The chickens need access to dry dirt uh, or sand. Dirt is best uh, for dusting, and the dusting helps them naturally take care of parasites. Uh, I recommend them free-ranging anyways, even if you have a run. Like, we have a pretty big run here. We still let them out every day. John says his children spend most of the time with a the flock. They have one chicken, Rocket, who loves escaping out of the coop to be around people. I like Rocket's friendliness. He always wants to be with you. He's like, come, when you get him in your hand, he jumps up on your shoulder and climbs onto your head sometimes. He's turned into our chicken whisperer, we call him. Uh, he does all the handling. He feeds them every day. He takes care of them. He gets them out the free range. Um, my youngest daughter, Annika, she, she's right in there too, helping. Uh, not as enthusiastic though as Matthias. He started his website and he blogs about them. The Wilsons let their chickens live out their days naturally. If they hatch too many roosters though, they will be needing to process or rehome them. There are various Facebook groups with people willing to take roosters or non-laying hens. In an IMO, residents can have up to six chickens, four if you live on a property that's less than 450 meters squared. Only hens, female chickens, are allowed in the city. We have heard many times, um, how do we get eggs if we don't have roosters? Because in the city, you're not allowed to have a rooster. All a rooster does is uh, fertilize eggs. Uh, the chickens will still lay their eggs. Commercial chickens usually lay every 24 hours, while heritage breeds lay less frequently, but for a longer period of time. It takes a chicken from hatch to six months of age to begin laying eggs. They're interesting animals. They're not just boring, give us eggs and meat things. Like, they're personable for sure. If you're thinking of getting hens to join your flock, Mateus's blog, chickens.thewilsons5.ca, has resources to help you out. For Go on Shaw TV, I'm Ryan the Plant.